I want to get rid of the vehicles in the background. So I'll first go to an isometric view, rotate the view. I'll zoom in around this area and I'll add an auto clipping box. I'll go ahead and turn the visibility of this clipping box off. I want to rotate it so that it's in line with the roadway. And now I'll start bringing in the sides. Bring down the top. What I want to do is rotate this so that I get the roadway as flat as possible. Now that I have it flat, I'll click on select polygon and carefully click just above the road. If you click on the road, you'll delete roadway points and have a big hole in the roadway. So now all that information is gone. Now, these uh, stripes here that we see, this is from the scanner where it hit the tire and it couldn't scan behind the tire. That was not a result of cleaning. Not much we can do about that, except move the vehicles and scan more positions. Now in this particular clipping box, rather than delete it, I'm going to use this clipping box to go up the roadway taking small sections at a time so I can clean the roadway using the same clipping box. Once again, using the polygon, I'll go in front of this what appears to be a mailbox and I've accidentally clicked the wrong place, so I'll try again. By the mailbox and staying just above the road surface. Doesn't have to be perfect guys. This uh, Just get it as close as you can. And now that area is clean. So once again, we're going to bring up red and then I'll move this other red forward and I'll see if there's anything in this area that I need to delete. Looks like I have uh, a person in the roadway. Uh, I'm going to save. And I'm just going to make the comment clean all so I know I cleaned all of the scans. Now, when Scene resaves this, it's going to have to rewrite all of the databases. So be prepared, this could take a few minutes to finish up.